Now what would make this fountain even better? If we filled it with blood. Welp, currently I am trying to find a way back to Moira so that I can give her a landmine. I don't know what she's going to do with a landmine, but I hope it's destructive. At least five people. At least five. But yeah, uh, looks like we're going to have to go back down to hell in order to get there. And by hell, I mean the subway system. The only kind of hell that I know exists. In this game. Yeah! That's what, you get for, that's what you get for spooking me. Prick. Six bottle caps. Not great, not terrible. Is this the way? I have no idea. This place is a freaking labyrinth. Oh. Well, that was easier than I thought it was going to be. Cool. I'm glad. Unless, of course, I have to go into another one, in which case, fuck you, game. Oh. Lovely. Stay down. Ugh. Die already. Is that how I get up? Through this tunnel? I guess it's worth taking a peek real quick. Hmm, ominous. God, they spooked me. Don't sneak up on people like that. Rude. Now you're dead. As you should be. I'm gonna heal myself with some, some soda, which is the exact opposite of how that works in real life. I should know. Oh. They gave me radiation poisoning. That is actually the most horrifying way to die possible. Good thing I have magic medicine that can make it all go away. I think I went the wrong way. Yeah, let me see here. Yep. Hmm. Nah, screw it. Back to hell, I go. Are you eating a guy? I want to eat a guy, but I can't get cannibalism until level 12. 
Why does it take me 12 levels to learn how to eat people? I guess I can steal his stuff. He won't be needing it. Am I distracting you from your dinner? Too freaking bad. This is why I hate these tunnels. They're so freaking confusing. What the? Oh, you did not. You did fucking not. I'm gonna cut you into sashimi, you son of a bitch. Oh, I already did. Heck. I can't wait to get a railway rifle. Choo choo! I think this is an ingredient. Heavy. Ah. Oh. Really, dude? That's the best you could do. Please, baton pathetic. I'm getting some free medicine for shish kebabbing that bitch. Yep, all good stuff. Let's see if I can use that bed now. Yep. See if I can make them come to me. Oh, you're not very smart. Oh wait, a turret control system. This might take a while. Try. Nice. Deactivate. I won because I'm smarter than you. Now it's only you. Oh, I'm dead? Oh, good thing you're not a doctor. Or a coroner. Fuck it. Somebody's a litter bug. Is it you? I bet it was you. Oh! I'm gonna have to be more careful. Oh! What did I just say, me? Oh god. I'm just gonna wait here until. Yum. So. Yeah, it's time for you to go to the afterlife. Nailed it. 
You took your own advice, dumbass. I broke a bobby pin on an easy lock. Of course. Bread pass card. I wonder if that'll come in handy. Oh, frick. Please, God, let this be over. Of course not. Of course fucking not. Why do you run towards death? With me, Benji. Ah, oh, crap, it's hole. I'm gonna put your bitches down like old yeller. Yeah, that's the one. Never saw that movie. No particular reason, I just. I never have. It just never fucking ends! How? How do you intend to do that? Oh, there's a button right here. Okay. Let me just... A shot of whiskey and yeah, okay, we're good to go. Nope. You wish. You wish. Uh Jesus for a while. This sound will haunt my enemies' nightmares. Provided they live long enough to have nightmares. Die. Subway tunnels are just a new kind of fresh hell, aren't they? Death. Rest in peace, headphone users. <sighs> Finally, the fucking sun. No, wait, no, it's nighttime. Fuck. I'm gonna make a. No, I, I think I can buy stuff here. No, nope, it stopped. At the tower. Oh, well, that was refreshing. Onward! Oh, well, would you look at that? We got us a smooth skin visitor. Ooh, we. We ain't seen one of your type in a long time. Can't imagine why. 
Why, you are handsome as a lot more, and it's worth coming thousands of miles. Tell your stay. Just try and keep from shooting up the place. We got a nice little deal going on down here. We'd like to keep it nice. Don't be ridiculous. I don't shoot people. I stab them. But not right now. Can you pay me? Oh, thank God. have any for you. Hmm. <laughs> oh, that... Oh, that was some good I'm afraid she's going to be out for a while. She's not well at all. Okay. Don't worry, though. I'm sure the rest of Riley's rangers will show up soon and take her home. Okay, thanks. No problem, just don't disturb the patients. Unless, of course, I murdered them at some point, which is rather possible. Oh, she's upstairs, maybe. Okay. Hello. No. Damn smooth skins. Hey there. Hi. Huh? Ah! Jesus Christ! Don't, don't sneak up on me like that. Last fella, last fella to do that damn near lost my arm. You lost your him. arm? Yeah. You must be, since you're actually talking to, talking to me. I'm patchwork. You're just patches if you like that. I don't like I'm that. Shit. I forget. Okay. There should be a guy around here who buys scrap metal. Well, hello again. You need something smooth skin? Me? I keep every hunk of old, rusted, pre-war garbage around here in operating condition. We've got lights, water, and ventilation all running off the old crap they used to keep this place going for the tourists. I've managed to keep it going so far, but, well, I'm not sure how long I can keep it up. That's actually pretty fucking impressive, considering that some of this shit is well over 200 years old. We've scavenged just about all the scrap metal from all the places we can safely get to. We're scraping the bottom of the barrel here. Hell, not before long I'm gonna have to disassemble poor old Cerberus for parts. Hey, you get around, don't you? Tell you what, you bring me back any scrap metal you find out there, and I'll trade you whatever I can. We can work out a trade. We've got some stuff around here that we don't need, but a smooth skin like you might make use of it. I enjoy money. Well, we got stim packs, but the doc keeps us healed up, so we don't really need them. So I could trade one of those for five bits of scrap metal. We also got us a ton of Radaway and Radex. I mean, what good is it to us? But I'll trade you either one for five bits of scrap. Your choice. That's some good stuff. Well, all right. That's good to hear, stranger. Just come on back to me when you've gathered some scrap metal. You'll find it just about anywhere. On junked robots, in old buildings, you name it. Give me stim pack. Oh, good. The vents are rattling again. I need to get up there and take care of it. What do you have? Ten parts, huh? All right, what do you want in trade? I'm a bit low on Radaway. All right, ten bits of scrap metal for two doses of Radaway. That's a done deal. I have to go. Let me know if you have any of that scrap metal to sell. Yep. Wonder if this person has that motorcycle gas tank I need. Oh, a human. Well, hello. Welcome to Underworld Outfitters. It's it's been so long since I had a customer. Then why do you have a shop? 
If any of the armor fails to protect your life, I'll give you a full refund. Oh, I see what you did there. <laughs> oh, let's see. That'll come in handy later. I'm not gonna afford it. Come back soon, please. Not if you're gonna be desperate, God. Hey there. Been busy testing? Huh? Oh, there you are. How are those hot little potatoes? Got one. Because, you know, they're on the ground. Like potatoes. And hot because they, um, explode. Anyway, what's up? I think potatoes are in the ground, not on the ground, but... You know, whatever. My very own landmine! Oh, just what I've always wanted! Well, always since I sent you out on this anyway. Now, tell me all about it. What was it like going through there? What's it like disarming a landmine? I'm just glad to have all my limbs. <laughs> you think I'm an idiot? I may be a little impulsive, but not an idiot. I'll just take a look at this on my own then. I know you may not want to see any more explosives for a while, but obviously you know your way around them. I have a couple rainy day toys of mine. And looking at this landmine, it gives me an idea. It's a terrible device that does terrible things, of course. But it's easy to make your own, too. I like the sound of that. Well, food and medicine. Everyone needs them once in a while, right? So they need a good place to find them. There's an old Super Duper Mart not far from here. I need to know if a place like that still has any food or medicine left in it. It's like 200 years old. Whatever. Oh, great! Food is most important, but see if you can get medicine, too. And if there's nothing to find, then just come back in one piece, okay? I know canned food lasts like a really long time, but would it survive 200 years? I don't know about that. Try not to die! That's the idea. Hey, there was probably more stuff I could do in there. I wonder if there's like a bar. Hey. That's a bathroom. Could happen to you. I I don't becoming a ghoul. Cool, then I could be an Im to sell? Uh, then I could be an immortal murder machine. Sick. Oh, like the Ninth Circle of Hell. It's pretty cool. We don't get a lot of your kind down here. Okay. No, go talk to Azraka. Well now, looky here. We got us a smooth skin that I ain't ever seen before. I'm Azrakal, and this this is the Ninth Circle. Folks got problems, and I got liquor to sell them. Well, liquor and a few other pick-me-ups, son. You need anything, uh, you just let me know. I'm surprised liquor affects ghouls. That's Sharon. Let's just say, well, he's a loyal employee. Don't mess with me, and he won't mess with you. He doesn't say much, does he? His company is rather refreshing, isn't it? But don't mistake his brevity for stupidity. That would be very unwise. Underestimating an opponent has been the last mistake of far too many individuals throughout history. I've met a lot of people like that. They're not very alive anymore. I hold his contract, which makes me his employer. He will do what I ask, when I ask, without question. You see, Sharon grew up around a very interesting group of individuals. They, well, I guess you could say that they brainwashed him. I'd like to He is them. absolutely loyal to whomever holds his contract. Unfailing, unflinching. 
until the day that employment ends. Don't get me wrong. I have no doubt that he holds no end of animosity towards me. But so long as he is my employee, he is as gentle as a teddy bear. Sweet. Oh, would you now? He's a highly valuable asset to me and to the Ninth Circle. What did you have in mind? Couldn't we work out some kind of deal? I suppose we could do that. Uh, although you might not like the deal that I have to offer. You see, I don't like competition. Not at all. I'd imagine not. It goes against every principle that I have as a businessman. So the fact that there is another source for booze in town troubles me. Greta, the waitress over at Carol's, I want you to kill her. I don't care how. Just make it quiet. Do it, and you can have Sharon's contract. Hmm. Okay. I'm glad to hear it. Come back to me when she's dead, and Sharon's contract is all yours. A word of advice. Be subtle. Open gunplay will only get the town to turn on you, and I will not be able to help you. Well, I suppose I'll have to up my stealth skill before I can pull that off. Come back anytime. That is something to keep in the back of my mind. I can't wait. Okay, let's see what we got. Hmm. I guess I should, could always try going to that, uh, that one town. The one that I haven't blown off the map. I just need to try and find out where it is. To the south, probably. Must. Nope. Well, yes, but actually no. Oh hey, I think this is the place that Three Dog would have wanted me to go to if he hadn't died mysteriously. And bequeathed his headband to me before his passing. Yep, totally what happened. <laughs> oh, what are we over here? Oh, that's a lot of somethings. Oh, it's all rotten roaches though, so pff, whatever. Does it have been worth the experience I get for this? It's nice to be able to light things on fire again, though. Trying to get anywhere, I'll probably have to take a subway at some point. Let's see. Is it radioactive down here? What did they do? That would explain the ghouls. Oh, 
Come on. Where the hell am I? What a frick. Is this a nuclear disposal site? I should not be down here! <laughs> oh, hello. Ugh. Should switch to the weapon that isn't on fire for now. Clearly, there's some sort of gas leak. Yep, there it is. Gas leak. Could have avoided those radioactive barrels. Ugh. I used Radex on this. I don't know how taking a pill prevents my cells from being fucked by radiation, but you know, whatever. Come on! Away! Oh! Come on! What's a super mutant doing down here? What am I doing down here? Why do babies keep exploding? I think I know what those guys are. Where's all my... Just how far away can I? <laughs> now I take some drugs and whip out my shish kebab. I take some psychomedics about. Yeah, yeah, okay. Come on. Why did the landmines even go off? What is it with landmines and not going off? It has to be the crappiest landmines ever. Got my entire plan. I might as well sell them for drug money. Pfft. 
Oh, it's, it's a mutey. Die! I'm on so many freaking drugs right now, you don't even know. wants to die. Try standing less close together. Ow. Can't fire at that this close range, can you, bitch? Dead. You're all fucking dead. Didn't work for the last guy, did it? Seriously, where the? Oh! I could have been standing next to that. from cars for the time being. <sighs> Come on. Well, I guess next time we'll have to descend yet again into hell. <laughs>